so looking back 20 years from now, if you look at, recall this experience of working on this film, is there a moment that would, um, you know, sort of come to mind for you as being the most memorable thing that happened on this? This it could be something in front of the camera, behind the camera. Well, there was, you know, there was a time, there was a moment where somebody uh, on the crew was, um, I'm gonna circles back to Mike just being the best. Um, it was a member of the crew who was just disrespectful to me in a way. Um, it was just like, leave it there. It was just the, the incident was just like, you know, hey, basically what the F, like, no, that's absolutely like not cool. <laughs> I didn't have, I mean, while I was about to defend myself or in the process of being like, yo, man, like you cannot do blah, 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 blah. You know, Mike just like swoops in like the superhero. <laughs> and he's like, he just shut it down. You know, he just shut it down, set the tone, um, that person. Uh, no longer was in my sphere and nothing like that happened again. Um, so yeah, um, again, it goes to like leadership and feeling like you're safe. Um, and that was, um, you know, I mean, I will cut your tires. Don't mess with me. Uh, but I, you know, <laughs> I don't, I didn't have to, Mike, Mike cut, Mike cut those tires <laughs> metaphorically anyway. Um, and of course, just shooting in the city because San Francisco is awesome. And then working on the same film with my husband, um, but we didn't actually have any scenes together. So we didn't actually work together at all, but you know, we were, you know, sharing an experience. Um, yeah, talk a little bit about that. I mean, that must've been an interesting. Um... Like how that even happened. You know, what's funny is I wasn't even, I, I wasn't auditioning for this movie. I didn't know anything about this movie. Mark's like, okay, this audition. He said, can you put me on tape? You know, actress self tape, whatever it was, uh, the producers were in San Francisco. Um, uh, I think that's how that worked. Yes, that's how that worked. And um, I just did the off camera dialogue. <laughs> they were like, Who's the person doing the hot camera dialogue? She's great. <laughs> oh, he's good. And uh, Robin, who was casting, she's like, that's Emma Caulfield. And I'm like, oh, we love her. Would she be interested? And in, like, whatever. And that's just, that's how that happened. And then, and I was like, uh, like, do we want to do a movie together? That's going to be weird. You don't. And was it? What was it like? Um, well, again, we didn't really work together, which is great because I, I, um, I, I just, I couldn't, I just don't, I don't know how people work with spouses. I don't, I just, I feel, I feel like there needs to be that separation of church and state. Do you know what I mean? Um, because then you're just like, you're, you're with the person constantly. And there's like, there's no, Hey, what happened? What, what happened with you today? Like, how was, how's life? How's work? And be like, we well, already know because you were there the whole day. You know, it's weird. I like, like, just this, the separation. And I, I don't like, you know, I, I don't know. I feel like I'd be embarrassed maybe a little bit too. Like, you know, like you're not a neutral party yeah. Kind, of, yeah. kind of situation. Um, very different, obviously, if we had worked together and that's how we met and then it would, you know, wouldn't be an issue. But um, it was a little adventure and it was, it was fun being up there. Mm -hmm.